Hello and welcome to Herdy Gurdy Basics, where we discover the Herdy Gurdy and its basics and its secrets. In this tutorial, you will learn how to apply cotton and rose into your Herdy Gurdy. To follow this video, please prepare your block or liquid rosin, clean cloth, and cotton from your Gurdy kit. I will be using cotton from a tampon as I usually do because it's practical and easily accessible even if I'm on tour. However, cotton is something you can experiment with a lot and you can find different kinds of cotton in the internet by searching for viscose fiber. So the first thing we're going to do is getting rid of the old cotton. Move the old cotton away from the wheel and scrape it off. Once your string is clean, put a little bit of rosin on the part above the wheel. Take a bit of cotton, hold the string above the wheel and place the cotton between the string and the wheel. Start moving the wheel forward and the cotton will wrap around the string. You can help it by pressing the string on the wheel so the cotton gets condensed. Changing the cotton can take practice, so I would recommend doing it quite often. First to get used to it, second to maintain good sound. Now it's time to apply rosin to your wheel. First let's do it with the block rosin. Grab your rosin and put it gently against your wheel. Turn it around once, so that the rosin gets applied evenly, then put a string on your wheel and play. Repeat until it sounds full and deep. If you're using liquid rosin, put a few drops on a clean cloth and then press it gently against the wheel. Move the wheel around to spread the liquid, then put a string on the wheel and play. Repeat until you're happy with the sound. With time you'll get a sense of how much cotton and rosin you need to apply to your herdy, so it sounds good. So how do you know it's time to change the cotton or apply new rosin to your hurdy-gurdy? Usually you should do it if you hear a change for worse in your sound. Let's say your sound is more quiet than usual, the string is less responsive than usual, or it starts making weird scratchy sounds, then the first thing you should take care of is cotton and rosin. Apply new cotton, add rosin and see what happens. If it doesn't help, it could be a different problem. For example, maybe you have too much rosin on your wheel and this you can fix by taking it away from the wheel with a clean cloth. Or it can also be wrong strings pressure. But about this we will talk in the future. Thank you so much for watching. I hope this video was helpful to you. If you have any questions, send me a message on my social media and we see each other next time. Bye!